I'll start with the title poem, Potato Soup. In the early years, she helped her mother plant fields, carry the dishpan out to the garden, digging, digging holes. What you eat is what you plant, her mother always said, that edible tuber common as dirt, a near daily staple. One grandmother left potato country long ago for this one. Another immigrated for the promise of more potato land. As she learned to cook, she began peeling alone at the sink, sticking a spare slice on her tongue, smell of starch lingering on her fingers. Mashed, fried, baked on Sundays for hours, regular as pulsating winds over the plains. Soon graduating to French fries and sizzling grease, to fermented spirits of the potato. Beginning with a certain look in an eye, relying on folklore, that time of month safe if planted at night under the expansive and unblinking moon. Graveling into the soil around roots to steal an eager potato or two. She's fond of the skin colors, the flesh, textures, exotic flavors. Moving on to potato salad years, quick boiled varieties from the hot tub. Decades here and gone, potato love constant. By now, she's concluded it's best on gradual simmer, consolation accompanying maturity. In the afternoon, she sautés onion and butter, stirs in flour and milk, chops celery, carrot, adds chicken stock. She thinks of the hour when they'll be eating, into twilight, of the long night ahead in front of the fire. Should she throw something in extra? or tang, or play, a measure of Chardonnay. Mm -hmm. All her life, she thinks, it has come down to this, bringing the bottle up slow to meet her lips. <laughs>